My name is Andrew, creator of Do, The Dark Face and Friends, and AS13. I'm an autistic guy from Arizona who's never been overseas in his entire life, and I'm about to take a solo vacation to Japan. Let's do this. Alright, the first moment in the history of my trip, we're about to find out that Japanese toilets are exactly like ours. What a relief. Want to see a magic trick? Oh! <gasps> Look at that! Oh, praise God, I'm finally outside. I thought that subway labyrinth would never end. Oh, I think I found my pad. Their food is better than Gundam Seed. It is. That's not Goku. That doesn't even close to what Goku looks like. It looks like a monkey. What? Oh right, Goku is a monkey. Never mind. That's that's Goku. That is a hundred percent Goku. I'm happy to report. Raleigh has been found! And over here we have the Eiffel Tower. Wait, what? Who would have guessed that the Eiffel Tower, Tokyo Tower, and One Piece Tower were all the same tower? Alright, you frickers! Take that! Oh boy. This is where she keeps her treasure. Let's pretend that never happened. Something super will happen. Oh. All right. Uh, let's try this one. Uh, nope. See what's over here. Little do they realize that the legendary treasure is just a Blu-ray of Pirates of the Caribbean Curse of the Black Pearl. <laughs> I'm totally kidding. Please don't hate me forever. You guys will not believe what I'm about to do next. All right, let's do this. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yep, that's right. I'm gonna name you Cleo. So apparently Cleo is a white Travali. Well, Cleo, we hardly knew ya. <laughs> Believe it or not, I'm actually super picky about dessert foods, but nice job, Kirby. Yeah, this was worth it. During my trip to the Kirby Cafe, I had a little trouble with the, uh, figuring out which train to take, so I thought, hey, I'll just walk. 
which resulted in even more confusion and delay and sweat like you wouldn't believe. Yeah, just stick with the train. Wanna know where I am now? Well, it's not the same, Denny's. I didn't see the bourbon bacon burger on the menu, but I think I'll be just fine. And this is what they call a salad. That's right, everything you see on the plate here came from the salad bar, therefore it is a salad. And nothing else. Man alive, I haven't seen so many Pokemans in one place before. How many do you think there are? Ten. Look, it's my favorite Digimon. Hanzomon. What is happening right now? They will be reading one of my favorites. The... Uh... Is that a guy or a girl? Pretty sure it's both. So here we got a double crane machine. Uh, on this side we got some kind of chocolate pretzel goldfish type deal. And of course next to that we uh, got a crane machine of real actual computer mouses. the real reason these things are a scam? Because sometimes they work! And now for something completely different. Why would they have a staircase that goes down if it's just gonna go up a few feet later? Garth! Garth! The thing about the Ghibli Museum is that they got some kind of strict uh, photo policies. Uh, you can't take any pictures indoors unless it's at cafes or maybe shops, otherwise you gotta take them outside, so... Um, the house that Totoro built, I think. The robot that Castle in the Sky built. The Allspark that Castle in the Sky built? Oh, uh, yep. Yeah, I think Castle in the Sky built this too. The cool glasses that Porco Rosso built. Casino Tiny Beer. In Japanese form, a Valley of the Wind beer. There happens to be a movie entitled Nausicaa of the Valley of the Wind. So, that being said, Nausicaa beer. Yeah! I don't know if that's Nausicaa, but it, it could be. It might be. Here we have Japanese Mickey Mouse. For a Japanese Disneyland, there sure is a lot of English text on most of these buildings. I mean, what if Japanese people come here? How are they gonna know what anything is? Oh, wait. Oh, look at that. And they can probably tell the same way I can tell whenever I get around anywhere. For your safety, remain seated throughout your flight with your restraints securely uh, what, fastened. What's that? I, I don't, I don't speak children. English. Uh, could you, could you give me that? And there we go. 
before the days of Granny as we went on down to the Penny Arcade. Before the days of Ski Ball, we used to have Ski Balls where you play as a guy playing Ski Balls. Back in the days of computer, I mean the days before computers, all we had were these little wooden Hey, wait a minute. 40 yen? That ain't a penny. That's at least 36 and a half pennies. The teapots are filled with coke? Man, Japan rocks. You know, these wishing wells are actually less of a scam than crane machines are, if you think about it. Well, I think I found out why this section of the park smells like crap. Oh, gosh. Do you know how easy it is to make waffles? Oh, yeah. Put the whole thing on the newspaper? Beautiful, Clark. Well, Cleo, we hardly knew ya. Alright, I'm back in Flaming Inferno Tucson, and let's see the stuff I got. Check out my haul. Over here we got Japanese Jingle All The Way. Uh, here's me with the uh, Pirates of One Piece. Here's me as a pirate, the time when I was a character in the show for one day, somehow. Here's some other One Piece stuff. Tokyo was full of One Piece merchandise. It's redonkulous. And here's Commando Nami. Yeah! Here's some CDs. More than I had intended, but some of these were dirt cheap. These two were like the equivalent of a dollar combined. Pamphlet from the uh, Ninja Trick House. Over here we got some gnarly waffle cookies. Uh, they come in chocolate, vanilla, and, what's this, green tea? Yeah, you gotta love those. And uh, what I actually didn't notice prior to buying these is that they're actually referred to as Choga Senbei. You'll uh, notice the little Dr. Slump reference there, Senbei. Alright, what else we got? Some stuff from the Kirby Cafe. Got a bowl. That was free. Coaster, that was also free. Some candy. That was not free. Uh, this is surprises for my family. I cannot reveal those yet. This is the uh, Hetsune Miku Project Diva controller for the uh, PS3. Uh, I've been looking everywhere for this. I can't believe I actually found it. Here's old Miku herself. Want her out of a uh, prize machine, you know, crane machine. You probably remember that. And uh, wearing another little Miku trinket that I got out of a vendor. Which is not a crane machine, it's just something that spits out a mystery item. Uh, what else? I mean, this CD came with this snazzy bracelet. And... Uh... Oh wait, there's one more item I forgot about. Nausicaa beer!